successful. We've been purchasing and processing flax straw for over 60 years and we felt that with the new growing interest in the bioeconomy and bio products that uh, there was an opportunity for us to become a secure source of supply of the raw feedstocks for biomaterials. My name is Joe Hoag. I'm the manager of new business development for SWM International. It all starts on the farm. Basically farmers uh, grow flax for the seed and in turn straw is disposed of on the farm through burning and so we have a, a seasonal straw purchasing operation that uh, operates every fall. We then bale it, uh, truck it, stack it and store it and then we process it uh, over the remainder of the year and then from there our raw materials are basically a pulp grade of flax that is sent to our paper mill in New Jersey and our, our paper mill in France. We've recently come out with a line of biomaterials called flax stock. These are all the new customers. These are the customers that range from erosion control, horse bedding, to fillers for plastics. Working with the Composite Innovation Centre, uh, Manitoba is really becoming a place where uh, we see a lot of interest in biocomposites from flax and from hemp. The driver of the bioproducts industry in Manitoba is sustainability. It's just a change in the attitude that people are looking at total crop utilization. And I think Manitoba having the second largest agricultural land base in, in Canada can become certainly a very big player and partner in supplying the raw materials. To grow this industry, uh, we need to let people know that we have a secure feedstock, uh, not just in hundreds of tons, but in thousands of tons. We are familiar with how agriculture works in Manitoba and on the prairies and so we get inquiries from people that want to use flax but they don't know any farmers. We just tell them, well, don't worry about that. We deal with a lot of farmers and if you're interested in flax and fiber and shive that we certainly are in a position to supply. Innovation is, is really what the, the whole bioproducts industry is about and we're creating all the new products that have never existed that don't exist, that are going to exist. And I think whether it's in transportation, uh, consumer products, or in green building materials, all these new products are, are in the process of being created and the companies who are going to be manufacturing them are, are all being developed today. So that's just pure innovation, pure and simple.